Welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. It is time to get back on track onto our quest line and we are going to be going to the shadow of the, or oh, in the shadow of the estate. We're actually going to be meeting one of our friend's sisters who is not very well and they will do absolutely everything they can to make her better. So we need to go to the map, decide where they are, which is a long, long, long way away. But fortunately for us, we do have a fast travel point very nearby. There is actually one there that I didn't unlock. So we'll uh, we'll go over to this one and then we'll fly there. And we will go and find out what's happening on the next leg of our adventure. I'm looking forward to the next trial that opens up. I really enjoyed doing the boss battle. This one thing that this game is lacking is boss battles. The combat in this is brilliant. But so far, the fights have been very easy. Now, I could, I guess, put this up to the hard difficulty, but I'm quite happy playing on normal. Um, it does say that it gives a good balance, but yeah, I would like, I'd like a couple more boss fights. That would be good. Here we go. I guess we have to wait. Any, uh, anything we can steal while we're, while we're waiting? of things down there well, a few chests about actually but we'll wait that's okay we don't need to uh, you made it deal just yet enjoying the view keeping an eye on things Feldcroft isn't what it used to be no one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there Rookwood Castle my uncle Solomon is a former aura and refuses to look into it even after Anne was cursed by one of them. Possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us. Which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anna I used to know. Come on. I'll take you to my uncle's. Okie dokie. Let's this go. Way. I'll follow you, shall I? Uh, let's uh, just activate Felt this flu network as we go by. With Ranrock's lot wandering Rebellion. about all the time. Everyone stays out of sight. Oh, but there's chess... The My sister chest. should be just inside. Oh man, Chesto, bro. I need to do looting. I got my favorite gloves on. Aha! Sebastian, where did you? Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure. When will you accept that? Never. I can never accept it. <laughs> now look what you've done. I'm sorry. I think we need to get her away from her father. It doesn't seem like he's got the healthiest sorry, attitude to towards that. getting her better. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. You know, poor Sebastian. Not the visit he'd hoped for. I'm sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. You ran Hogwarts isn't the same without you. Well, Sharp is still at foul. That's foul, but you don't know. You know what I mean. Oh, man. Feel bad coming in here to steal your stuff, but it uh, needs it, you know. Are you all right, Anne? I, I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. <laughs> and I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts, and often suddenly, it's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh dear, Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother and me in line. 
<sighs> I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cosy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. I wish you well. Revelio. Sebastian, this is my potion kit, not yours. Leave my things be, Anne. Oh, Sebastian, you've been pinching your sister's potions. Okay, so we had a chat with Anne. There was a chest behind here. The father clearly doesn't need things. He's a horrible person, so we'll steal his stuff. Oh, he stole his hat. I'll show him. Get cold head in the winter now. There are a couple of chests just uh, kicking about at this house over here. So before we go and see Sebastian... Is this level oh, level two unlock? Of course it is. At least we can get the one from the outside. That's fine. You ready to talk, bro? No, you're not. Okay. So I guess we go have a chat with the dad. That boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes. Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. I was about to check on Anne. Did I see you come from the house? How is she? She's all right. She said she was going to rest. Nothing can be done for her. It could be that you've not yet discovered the cure. Ah, you sound like Sebastian, thinking you know better than the healers at St Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne, and the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the Loyalists' way. I disagree. With due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. I hope you'll remember what I've said. Revelio. Good day. I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. I will remember what you've said, sir. However, I shall take it upon myself to find a cure by going and beating the living daylights out of those nasty trolls. Aloha, but before I do that, a little bit of stealing is in, in order, I believe. So, there we go, special zone just there, and oh, there it is. Lovely, lovely. Inside your neighbor's house, sir, and uh, take what belongs to me now. I just want you to know I have claimed your village and all of its ways inside it. I will allow your people to live here for as long as they see fit. But should they come in the way of me trying to take their belongings, they will meet their doom. I am on the, the path to potentially being a dark wizard unless Miss uh, whatever her name is, my favourite lady in the whole world, decides she's uh, suddenly going to profess her love for me. If she doesn't, I feel the dark side coming on strong. Alohomora. Realistically, though, I uh, this is a long game, and it's a very long game to get into. Like, just we've not even start unlocked everything yet, and we've been twenty plus hours in. I would love to do two playthroughs: one as a good wizard and one as a bad wizard. I think that would be brilliant. Well, I, I, I don't have the time to do both. 
So I'm really toying with the idea, do I... Do I... Do I push towards the bad side a little bit and see what happens? But I kind of don't want to ruin being a good wizard. I feel like I've played it very straight and very good so far. Me. She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance of what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. I know he's angry, but he's only trying to do what he thinks is best for Anne. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son, as if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. No problem. Let's go beat up some uh, so nasty goblins. More than people realize. They should not be underestimated. Go on, then. Take me to the site of the event. All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. For something, you say? Sounds suspicious. Very Up suspicious. There, on that plateau okay. is where they cursed Anne. This right. way. So you're saying if I get up there, I can find a cure? Is that what you're telling me? Oh, I'll do it. Expected to dig through this rubble. Ramrock knows what he's doing. Ooh. It's an honor to be a part of it. Hey, guys. Guess who it is? Guess who's back? Back again. Exploderation! No, thank you. No, thank you. Don't you hurt my friend. He might not be as strong as you guys. Explode! Well, we dealt with those swiftly and I should say rather easily. Oh, hang on a minute. Have I? Are you sure you're not a <laughs> Not quiet enough. Oof, I wasn't paying attention. Sorry. Let me can try that again. <laughs> Have your axe back, sir. I feel nice to hit. How maybe you'd like a box to the head? Would you like an axe? Would you like an axe? Ooh, hang on a minute. I got popped from behind, mate. Ooh, wrong one. Oh, jeez. You're a bit, uh... Back this Confringo. way. I've been fighting since you Not quite. You won't stop me. Confringo. Hmm, I could really do with uh, my other moves. Ah, there we go. Popped it. Mm. 
all of Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Nice work. You're welcome. I confess, Rebellion's a bit more than I bargained for. I tried to warn you. Don't worry, I got your back, bro. I'm the wizard that survived. I am the ultimate wizard warrior of all of wisdom. Don't forget that. Tell your friends. I don't have repair. Yeah, I do. Go fix that. Don't, don't you worry, wizarding kind people. Rebellion. All the people from Wizarding Land. I will solve all of your oh, problems by going back to the quest area. Following my friend. Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelt smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. It may be grasping at billywigs, but I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her. Which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're I wonder right. if it's ancient magic. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here. And it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? We shall. They seem Rebellion. to have set up camp here for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. I've heard that goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the Ministry isn't doing more. One? One coin? Sort of... what a... nonsense work. My goodness me. Rebellion. They're quite poor, these goblins. They don't have much money to steal. Is there any point? Any point in killing things that don't have any money? Brown leather gloves. Brown leather gloves. What's this thing then? Whose home Shall is investigate. this? Shall investigate. Bit abandoned Who's long since I've lived here. Rumor was a Hogwarts professor lived here once, centuries ago. But that's all oh. I've heard. Oh. So are they, they uh, digging? Taking a closer look at the house itself. What house? Are they digging for what they think is buried under the professor's house? Rebellion. Sebastian, over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be. But it looks to me as though this was intentional. To stop the painting from talking. Well... Can we repairio it? Repair her. No. No is the answer. Now what, Maestro? Search the estate for clues. Okay. Revelio. No problem. We shall find all of the clues. Hmm. First of all, I'm going to investigate Sebastian. this. I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. This well looks familiar. Talk to Sebastian. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you... I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. 
The Keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. She was one of the Keepers. The Keepers? Like in Quidditch? And you found a pensive in the library? I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves Keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by Keepers. Yes. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch Keepers hundreds of years ago. If I didn't yes. know you, I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the Keepers. Look at this. Mm. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it Gadoosh! Only one way to find out. What is it? <gasps> a secret stairway! But where could it lead? Why bother blocking a stairwell? Confront. There might be something here worth a closer look. They've left a resto momentum strewn about. Lumos. Tells me there are Rebellion. bigger. I traveled here to learn, but long to help. My internal struggle is overwhelming. It's as though the magic wants to heal, and I'm the only one preventing it from doing so. I lose hope I will forever regret not having done more. I cannot look into their eyes knowing that I could lessen the burden of heartache. I saw the man leaving camp today, the one who reminded me of my father. Surely it wouldn't hurt to help him. I could further my research, of course. That would be a fortuitous consequence of doing something good with this ability. It seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Indeed. I kind of want to go behind there. There we go. You're not going oh. to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. Not a daydream, buddy. Not a daydream. I know it sounds strange, but... Honestly, I... nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. And I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows, I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be flawed. We can. But perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even Ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway, here we come. Here we go, guys. I'm secret invisible ancient breath. passageway. Well, we've got a bunch of these. Doors. But we've only... It said one of seven. Ah. I guess we'll find these in other, in other areas then. Go to the Undercroft. Maybe there's more clues in there. Interesting. Very interesting. It's almost like it's all connected. Why would the door lead us here? Circles on the floor, bro. Sebastian, I know they look. mean something. Ooh. That reminds me very much of that hallway we were in in the last episode. There's a painting on one side. Painting missing from the middle. But there is a map. Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A note. Let's have a look. A rune diagram. 
Mm-hmm. Anything helpful in the notes? No, not really. A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not. Sounds worth looking into. Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I have Ooh, no yes, idea please. our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. Yeah, keep your mouth shut. I'll be in touch. Till then. Don't you be sharing me secrets with anyone else. Otherwise, me and you are going to fall out, sunshine. You understand me? You will get... One of them. Okay? Good. I'm glad we had this talk. Rebellion. Right. Is there anything in this room we didn't get last time we were here? Doesn't look like it. I think we got everything. Okay, good. So what does that lead us to next on our quest? Oh, we got two. The High Keep and Astronomy class. Now, we haven't been to Astronomy class before. Attend Astronomy class and meet Natty at uh, Falbarton Castle. We will need Wingardium Leviosa for that one. And that's not going to do anything, apparently. So, I guess we'll probably go and meet... Uh, we'll do Astronomy class first because it's a lower level. But yeah, we will do that in the next episode because even though it's a bit shorter than normal uh, I don't think we should be taking on a whole new main quest mission at this particular point 